Okay, so let's solve this problem. So what must be the value of k? So that 5k minus 3, k plus 2, and 3k minus 11 will form an arithmetic sequence. Since this one is an arithmetic sequence, so therefore, we can solve for the common difference. That's a sub 2 minus a sub 1. Or you can use this formula to solve for the common difference a sub 3 minus a sub 2. So from the given, this one is a sub 1, a sub 2, and a sub 3. So we're going to equate these two equations to solve for k. So for the first common difference, we have a sub 2 minus a sub 1. So we have now this k plus 2, then minus a sub 1. That's 5k minus 3. Then A equals the second formula for the common difference. A sub 3 minus A sub 2. So A sub 3, that's 3k minus 11. Then minus A sub 2, that's k plus 2. Then simplify. So we have now k plus 2. Distribute this negative, so this positive 5k becomes negative 5k, and this negative 3 becomes positive 3. Then equals 3k minus 11, then distribute this negative, so this positive k becomes negative k, and this positive 2 becomes negative 2. Then combine like terms. So we have this k minus 5k or 1 minus 5 since 5 is greater than 1 so therefore this one is negative and 5 minus 1 that's 4 so we have now negative 4k then this positive 2 and positive 3 so that's positive 5 then equals on the right side so we have 3k minus k or 3 minus 1. So 3 minus 1, that's 2k. Then this negative 11 and negative 2, since both negative, so just copy the sign, then add the numbers. So 11 plus 2, that's 13. So that's negative 13. Then to solve for k, so we need to transpose this positive 2k to the left side. So this becomes negative 4k. So this positive 2k becomes negative 2k. Then equals negative 13. Then transpose this positive 5 to the right. So this positive 5 becomes negative 5. Then simplify. So we have negative 4 negative 2 so the same negative just copy then add the numbers 4 plus 2 that's 6k then equals so this negative 13 negative 5 so the same negative just copy the sign then add these numbers 13 plus 5 that's 18 then to solve for k so divide by negative 6 both sides so cancel, so therefore k is equal to negative divided by negative, that's positive, and 18 divided by 6, so k is positive 3. So therefore k is equal to positive 3. So if we're going to check the answer from this given, so if k is equal to positive 3, so 5 times 3, that's 15. And 15 minus 3, that's 12. Then for the second term, so k is 3, so 3 plus 2, so 3 plus 2, that's 5. Then for the third term, so if k is positive 3, so 3 times 3, that's 9. And 9 minus 11, that's negative 2. So if we're going to check the common difference, so from 12 to 5, this one is negative 7. And from 5 to negative 2, that's also negative 7. 
So therefore, the common difference is negative 7.